Hey everyone, welcome to Fast Performance TV. I'm Claudio Encina. I'm standing in a different position, or should I say sitting down in a different position, thought to you I would reach out and be totally different. We're gonna sit at a desk from now on and see what this comes across. So I'd love to hear your feedback through Facebook or just email me anytime. So I've been getting a few agents giving me a call recently and saying they've been losing a few listings. Now we know the market at the moment is pretty tight and listings are low. What are you doing to earn the business? Because the question right now is, are you a needy agent? Needy agents beg for business all the time. And people don't want to work with needy people. People want to work with people who've got results, confidence, and actually add value. So over the next few weeks, I'm going to share a couple of videos and share with you value hooks. You may not have heard of that terminology, but you will now. And if you implement it into your business, you're going to wheel a whole lot more listings heading into the second half of this year. So. What does begging for the business look like? Begging for the business is someone, you ringing up a prospect and going, hey, it's Claudio calling here from ABC Realty, just sort of seeing how things are going. Have you made a decision yet with your agent? That sounds like a needy agent and it sounds like you're begging for the business. And it also sounds like, guess what? Is my commission check ready? So how can we add value to these people and give them a hook? Well, the first thing is, you're gonna go back and do a series of value hooks when you get back to the office after you've done a market appraisal. And one value hook that I wanna share with you today is, for example, we're working with a lot of sellers, but they're also buyers. And they're going out to you right now and saying, Claudia, we wanna buy, but there's nothing to buy, but we've also got something to sell. So we're stuck in this goddamn cycle and it, you know it's become their reality trap where they can't see anything. So working with buyers and sellers is a great way to add some value hooks. One of the things that I've found that you can really hone into these guys is getting your mobile phone. Have I got mine? Harry, can I have my mobile phone? Just there. Harry's gonna be. Thank you, Harry. <laughs> there we go. And you get your mobile phone and you go out to your next listing when you're taking the photos and the floor plans and you're getting your copywriting done. But take your phone and just go out there. Now we're not doing a selfie, but we're going out of the property and say, hey Nick, it's Claudio here from ABC Realty. I know you've been looking for a three bedroom home up here over the Northern Beaches. And I've got to tell you, we have a beautiful home that I've seen today and we're taking photos. And I think this could really fit the features and benefits of what you're looking for in the marketplace. If you like this home and you'd like to get and see it before it comes onto the market via the internet and all the mainstream media, give me a call and it'd be my pleasure to get you through. A simple idea like that, guess what happens? You create an experience versus providing service. Service is where buyers receive an email alert every day, each week from different agencies, realestate.com, domain.com, versus an experience that's real and raw. That's what people remember. How can you stand out and add value hooks so you can win and earn the business? We're gonna talk about a couple more value hooks over the next couple of weeks, so stay tuned, look out for them, and hopefully you can win a lot more business. Remember, stay focused, stay in control, and always stay in action.